Hey everyone, I have been gone for quite some time. I'm sorry. <laughs> Hope you're still checking for my videos. But I have amazing news to share with you guys. So if you're interested in that, stay tuned. Hey everyone, if you're new here, my name is Dani Christine. I'm a childcare business owner, consultant, and wannabe lifestyle content creator here on YouTube. And now I'm happy to say that in addition to offering you guys consultation services, for those of you that would prefer a less expensive option, I now offer courses. You can get online learning courses from me about the startup process of your child's care business. So if you're thinking about or currently in the process of starting a child care program, or even if you already have one and you're just in the beginning stages and you need some more guidance or just have some questions about what you could be doing better, I would strongly encourage you to visit childcaresites.com slash courses in order to see if there's any information that I can give you that would be of service. Currently, as of March 2020, all of my courses are under $20 each. I'm going to keep it that way for a little while. Um, prices are going to increase soon, so if you're interested, go check out childcaresites.com slash courses and see where I can help you. Now on to this video. So if you're watching this video, you've probably thought about opening your own child care business or you probably already have one or you've had one in the past. You're in the industry, most likely. Now, if you're in the process of starting one or if you're thinking about starting one and are indecisive about whether you should or shouldn't, the most important question that I want you to ask yourself is, why are you doing it? Why do you want to do it? Owning a business, but specifically a childcare business, is no easy venture. It is challenging to say the least and it comes with a lot of struggle and you can be faced with adversity at times, especially in the beginning. Google's adversity. Does anybody else use words that sound right but don't know what they mean, but then you end up using it correctly? Context clues. But anyway, in the beginning you could be faced with a lot of challenges and it's hard work. It's not easy. It's not just changing diapers all day and wiping up drool. It's really not, especially if you are the owner and if you are thinking about it in profitable terms if you want your business to make money if you want to grow if you want to create the lifestyle that you want to live it's important for you to understand exactly what is going to motivate you to do what you do every morning every morning you have to wake up and actively choose make the conscious choice to keep going to that daycare center or keep going downstairs and opening your home daycare door for your families to come into your home it's it's not going to be easy if you don't even like doing what you're doing so i think it's important that you figure that out first discovering why it is that you want to open a child's care business is something that i cover in the first course that is available on my website childcaresites.com courses it is labeled as questions that need answers if you're struggling to figure out exactly why you want to open a daycare and by that I mean something bigger than just I like kids or I like money so I want to make as much of it as possible and I know I can do it with childcare. You're going to need a little bit more than that because every day that you go into your program and your staff tries you, these kids try you, the families choosing to do business with you are gonna try you, you're going to need that motivation to keep going again the next day. So figure it out. 
what kind of personal lifestyle do you want to live in the next five years, 10 years, or 20 years from now? If you're still in those beginning stages of questioning whether or not this is something you actually want to do, if it's something that you actually want to invest everything that you have in, because opening a childcare program is expensive in itself, especially if you're doing center-based first, you might take out a second mortgage on your house, you might get a loan, you might be investing all of your life savings into the possible success of this business. What are the pros and cons of this business venture? Have you thought about that? If you haven't, this is something that I go over in much more detail in my questions that need answers course on childcaresites.com slash courses. This specific course is only $9.99 and I want to do something special for you guys because this is such an important question. Currently, I have several courses posted on that website and there's gonna be so much more to come. From now until April 2020, if you purchase any two other courses and send me an email to info at dannychristine.com, I will give you the questions that need answers course for free. So it'll be a three for two deal. Again, like I said, all of the courses that are listed on that website are currently under $20. They all bring you immense value and help you in making important decisions on your childcare business journey, whether you're thinking about starting, just starting, or have already started. These courses are important. And again, if you purchase any other two courses from now until April 1st, 2020, I will give you the questions that needs answers course for free. If my explanation of this offer is a little too confusing for you, you can read the instructions again in the description below. Again, this is a special deal that I'm offering you guys and I hope that you take advantage of it. And I really hope that my course helps you to figure out exactly why it is that you want to start a daycare and helps you figure out the pros and cons of the business. I'm not gonna lie, the first few years is exhausting. I truthfully believe that owning any business, but specifically a childcare business, owning that business alone is like having a baby. And the startup process is much like a newborn. The first few years, I could barely sleep because throughout the day, I was taking care of the children. I was actively teaching them, providing childcare for them throughout the daytime. And then at night, I was working on things like policy development, procedures, paperwork, marketing strategies, growth strategies. That couldn't happen while I was changing diapers and cooking. <laughs> Not to mention when I'm away from my business, I'm constantly worried about it. Just like a child. <laughs> Just like I'm sure you guys that have kids, if you are worried about your child's health, safety, and well-being, I'm always worried about my business's health, safety, and well-being. It's a lot of hard work, but do I think that it's worth it? Yeah, and that's because I know my why. It's because I knew that this is something that I really wanted to do. But how will you feel? That's all for this video, you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.